Ever pondered about studying in Australia and what skills are in high demand there? If so, you're in the right place. Today we're shedding light on the skills that are highly sought after down under. Australia, known for its diverse economy and innovative industries, has a strong demand for various skills. For instance, the tech sector is booming. From data analysts to software engineers, the demand for tech skills is skyrocketing. Australia's digital economy is growing at a rapid pace, and the need for specialists in cybersecurity, artificial intelligence, and data science is more significant than ever. But it's not just tech. The healthcare sector is another big player. With an aging population and a world-class healthcare system, Australia is in need of a broad range of medical professionals. Nurses, doctors, physiotherapists, and mental health professionals are just some of the roles that are in high demand. And let's not forget about trade skills. The construction and mining sectors are thriving in Australia, creating a strong demand for electricians, plumbers, and carpenters. These skills are not only in demand but are also highly valued, offering excellent job prospects and competitive salaries. Now why does this matter to you as a potential international student? Well, possessing these in-demand skills can significantly increase your chances of securing a job after your studies. Australia is keen to retain international talent, especially in these critical sectors. Therefore, if you're studying in one of these fields, you'll have a higher likelihood of gaining employment and possibly even permanent residency. But don't worry if you're not yet proficient in these areas. Australian institutions offer a plethora of courses and degrees in these fields, providing the opportunity to acquire these in-demand skills during your studies. So, if you have or are interested in these skills, Australia could be your next study destination. Not only will you get a world-class education, but you'll also be studying in a country that values and needs your skills. Stay tuned for our next segment, where we'll discuss the various visa options for studying in Australia. Now that you're aware of the skills in demand, what are your visa options for studying in Australia? Australia offers a variety of visa options for international students, each catering to different study purposes. However, the most sought after is the Student Visa Subclass 500. This visa type allows you to stay in Australia to study full-time in a recognized education institution for up to five years. The requirements for the Student Visa Subclass 500 are quite clear-cut. You must have an enrollment confirmation from an Australian educational institution and meet the English language, health, and character requirements. You must also have a welfare arrangement if you are under 18. Additionally, you will need to show proof of financial capacity to cover your tuition fees, living costs, and travel expenses. The Australian Immigration Department wants to ensure that international students can support themselves during their stay. Now let's talk about the benefits. The Student Visa Subclass 500 is not merely a ticket to study in Australia. It also grants you the freedom to work up to 40 hours per fortnight during the semester and unlimited hours during the semester break. This is a fantastic opportunity for students to gain work experience in their field of study and earn some income. Moreover, this visa type allows you to bring family members to Australia as your dependents, so if you're planning to have your spouse or children with you, this is definitely a visa to consider, but remember the student visa subclass 500 is just one of many options. There are other visa types like the training visa subclass 407, and the Student Guardian Visa Subclass 590, each with its own unique set of requirements and benefits. To sum it up, Australia provides a range of visa options to cater to the diverse needs of international students. Whether you're pursuing a short-term course, a full degree, or even a doctoral program, there's a visa for you. Choosing the right visa is crucial to your study and stay in Australia, so make sure you explore all your options. Australia boasts of world-renowned universities, but what's the study culture like? Well, let's unravel that mystery together, shall we? The Australian university system is a blend of tradition and innovation. It's a system that values the pursuit of knowledge, critical thinking, and creativity. The universities here place a strong emphasis on practical learning and research, giving students the chance to apply their knowledge in real-world situations. The goal is to create well-rounded individuals who are ready to take on the world. There are more than 40 universities in Australia, each with its own unique strengths. From the University of Melbourne, known for its exceptional programs in medicine, law, and arts, to the University of Sydney, a leader in the fields of business and architecture. And let's not forget the Australian National University, a powerhouse in the areas of politics and physics. These institutions are globally recognized for their excellence and are constantly striving to push the boundaries of knowledge. But what sets Australian universities apart 
is their approach to education. They encourage students to think independently, to question, to explore. They foster a culture of intellectual curiosity, where learning is not just about memorizing facts, but about understanding the world around us. This is coupled with a strong emphasis on research, with many universities offering opportunities for students to participate in cutting-edge studies in a variety of fields. The study culture in Australia is also incredibly diverse, with students from all corners of the globe bringing their unique perspectives to the classroom. This multicultural environment enriches the learning experience, promoting a global outlook and fostering a sense of community among students. And let's not forget about the support system. Australian universities provide a range of services to help students succeed, from academic support to mental health resources. There's a strong focus on student well-being, ensuring that everyone has the tools they need to thrive. Studying in Australia isn't just about gaining a degree, but also about experiencing a unique study culture. This culture is one that values diversity, encourages curiosity, and fosters a love for learning. It's about more than just textbooks and exams. It's about growing, exploring, and making a difference. So, where will you live and how will you manage your expenses while studying in Australia? It's a question that's probably been playing on your mind. Let's delve right into it. Australia offers a plethora of student accommodation options to suit every budget and lifestyle. The most common choice for beginners is university-managed housing, such as dormitories or residential colleges. These are generally on campus or nearby, providing a safe, convenient, and social environment to help you settle in. However, if you're seeking a more independent living experience, private rentals might be your cup of tea. Apartments, share houses, or homestays are all part of this category. While they require more responsibility like managing utilities and cooking, they offer a taste of true Australian living. Just remember to factor in the cost of furniture, utilities, and transport to campus when considering this option. Now let's switch gears and talk about part-time work. As an international student in Australia, you're permitted to work up to 40 hours per fortnight during the academic semester and unlimited hours during vacation. This not only helps you manage your expenses, but also provides valuable work experience and a chance to mingle with locals. The job market for students is quite diverse. You could find work in retail, hospitality, or even on campus. There are also opportunities for internships related to your field of study, giving you a head start in your career. Before you start work, it's important to know your rights. Australia has stringent laws to protect workers, including students. You're entitled to a minimum wage and workplace conditions as per Australian standards. Familiarize yourself with these to ensure you're not exploited. Also consider getting a tax file number or TFN. It's a unique number issued by the Australian Taxation Office and it's a requirement for anyone planning to work in the country. With numerous accommodation and part-time work options, you can make your Australian study journey comfortable and financially manageable. So pack your bags and get ready for an exciting chapter in the land down under. Scene script. Finally, what do you need to check off your list to secure a student visa for Australia? Well, let's dive right into it. Firstly, you'll need to fulfill the academic requirements. This typically means you'll need to have been accepted into a full-time course at an Australian educational institution. The institution will provide you with a confirmation of enrollment, or COE, which you'll need to submit with your visa application. Next, onto the financial requirements. You have to demonstrate that you can cover your tuition, living costs, and travel expenses for the length of your stay. This could mean showing savings, a scholarship, or financial support from a sponsor. Moving on, there are health and character requirements. You may be asked to undergo a health examination to prove that you're in good health. As for character, you'll need to provide a police certificate to show you have a clean criminal record. Now let's talk about English language proficiency. Unless you're from an English-speaking country, you'll likely need to take an English language test. The required score varies depending on the institution and the course, so make sure you know what's needed. And of course, you'll need to fill out the visa application itself. This will involve providing your personal details, outlining your study plans, and possibly answering a few additional questions. Remember, every application is unique, and these are just general guidelines. You may need to provide additional documents or meet other requirements, depending on your circumstances. It's also worth noting that the visa application process can take several months, so it's best to start preparing as early as possible. Lastly, don't forget about your passport. It should be valid for at least six months beyond your intended stay. With this checklist in hand, you're now ready to embark on your journey to study in Australia. So, put your best foot forward 
and get ready to experience all the incredible opportunities that studying down under has to offer. Let's take a moment to quickly recap what we've learned so far about studying in Australia. Firstly, we discussed the high demand for skills in various sectors such as technology, healthcare, construction, and mining. This means that not only can you acquire valuable skills in Australia, but there's also a good chance you'll find job opportunities after you graduate. Secondly, we delved into the visa options for studying in Australia. With the Student Visa Subclass 500 being the most popular for international students. Remember, securing this visa requires you to meet academic, financial, health, character, and English language proficiency requirements. Next, we explored the rich study culture at Australian universities where knowledge, critical thinking, and creativity are highly valued. And let's not forget the diversity of student life, which means you're sure to find a community where you feel at home. We also touched on the various accommodation options and part-time work opportunities available to students. These can help you manage your living costs and gain practical experience while studying. And finally, we went through a detailed checklist to secure your student visa, covering everything from academic requirements to health checks and English language proficiency tests. With all this information at your fingertips, you're now well equipped to start planning your study journey in Australia. Remember, preparation is key, so start early and stay organized. It might seem daunting, but with the right approach, you'll be ready to take on this exciting new chapter in your life. So gear up for the adventure that awaits you down under.